I am a visionary. For the GTC conference in 2017, we debuted a new series called I Am AI. We had wanted to use an AI voice to narrate, and the results were promising, but they really didn't quite sound human enough. I am even the narrator. And it wasn't until early 2020 that our internal AI research team had actually developed a voice called Flotron that sounded quite human. I am a storyteller, giving emotion to words. So we've been trying for quite some time to have a speech synthesis that sounded natural. Finally, we did it. So it was successful in that way, but it was certainly not complete. I wanted to be able to direct the AI voice the way I direct a human. We started working on a model called Rat TTS that would allow the director to actually record his or her own voice and guide the persona's voice. That was the next step. With Rad TTS, I could record myself saying a particular line when I emphasized a word, when I put more energy into a word, when I lowered or raised my pitch or slowed down. It would affect the AI actor's voice that way. I am even the narrator of this story. I am even the narrator of this story. In working with Raphael, he taught me that words are music. Speech has notes, has rhythm. As a speech researcher, from the music background, I'm always listening to the voice as this instrument that I can manipulate. Something that I'm very fond of is Etta James. I wanted AI to sing like Etta James. My love has come along. With this model, we now have this liberty to create artistic things. You as a human are using AI to assist you to create a work of art. I am AI, brought to life by the researchers at NVIDIA and inspired minds everywhere. <laughs>